Oh, Ooh. she's... <laughs> Alright, cool. Grand Finals set number one, minimum. I say set number one because Comaster is a legend when it comes to losing in Grand Finals. <laughs> um, or resetting the bracket and winning. <laughs> this is Yeah, this is a matchup I can see Logos winning in. Um, I mean, I don't know. Every time I see him play, he does well. But, uh, <laughs> Comaster's laughing about that laser. <laughs> the stand-up laser. I feel like in this matchup, Logos is just gonna have to not like overexert. Well, kind of like right there. Overextend and just get yeah. for it. Yeah. Especially because like you'll try and chase him up on a platform, and he has good, such good platform movement that he'll just like wave land up air you or wave land knee, or just like, or, like do it on a hard three. Wave land off the stage or like ah. off, the, off the platform. And, oh, oh my gosh, the reeds! You guys can hear it. But Logos went no, <laughs> like he was an animal in the wild getting. That was just murdered. like stomp read, knee read, and then just YOLO. <laughs> and Logos gives it right back, zero to deaths all around, dude. Wow, this is a pretty good play. That was the lowest laser I've ever seen. Is that how you started up? Ooh, nice back air. Ooh. Oh, Comas with the SDE trademark. That's one thing I think a lot of people don't do against uh, Captain Falcon is like... SD? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's like, kidding. take the ledge before he even uses his second jump. Because once he's got the ledge, I mean, he's got invincible options and whatnot. Yeah, I don't know. Ooh. Wow, barely missed, avoided that four tilt. Ooh, drops too low. We're going to have last stock situation. Pretty Yo, fast shout out here. to Lime. I've got 80 followers, dude. Let's go. <laughs> Nice shines. Oh, Ooh, uh, barely avoids that dare. Crash cancel. Crash cancel. You just. Oh, Ooh, the four tilt was so good. Wow, four, Comaster knows it. Going way down there with that four tilt. Comaster laughs, but he's like, man, in set number two, when I have to go Luigi, it's going to be really fun. Comaster actually loves Yoshi's, which is like counterintuitive for both the characters he plays. Fable, the set score was 3 0. Why is Fable a mod? He deserves to be a mod. I want to be a mod. Oh, forward smash? Oh. He's, that was good DI, but he's dead. Okay, Combat was crazy. I forgot. Never mind. Yeah. The shine turn around down here and. Couldn't really do anything. He was super dead. <coughs> but Common Master thinking Logos was good enough to hit that tech. Ooh, wow. the shine down there. He's not dead though. Oh, get hugged. That's why Common Master loves Yoshi's because he never dies because of the wall jumps. Like, yeah. he's so good at it. That's oh. death. Yeah, he's. Common Master's crazy. Oh, that's death for both of them. Common Master needs to put in a sane asylum. Alright, so we have a spelling mod. I like that. I like that. I'm gonna predict that Logos takes this set 3 1. And then the next set. Oh, that laser out of nowhere. He's dead. Oh! Oh, that should have been Why? hit. Why? This could he go tried, either he way tried now. To style on him. You're Falco, dude. Yeah, dude. You, you can lose your stock at any moment. He, just two reads, and it's all it takes. Back air again. Falco Thomas is that. not gonna DI, dude. Or not DI. Die is what I meant to say. Nice back air. Nice back Like, he could have gotten hugged right there. And he would have had attack. Scary stuff, man, playing as Falco. But in uh, set number two, if Commaster doesn't at least stop going Falcon and go Luigi, he's going to turn it up. Oh, yeah. This is Luigi's nuts, dude. Oh, nice grab from Logos. The down tilt so far away. The only thing that would have hit ever. How do you feel about this stage for Falcon in this matchup? Terrible. Yeah, I don't really I feel like get it. The stage it. is super awful. Like, I feel like it's just downright unwinnable. Especially with how good Commaster is with those platforms. Like, I don't and really. I get don't it. think this stage is a testament to good Falcons because uh, I've definitely lost sets to Falcons, where I game one they beat me, game two I take them here and I three stock them, and game three they beat me again. Yeah. No, it's, it's just weird. Crowmaster's another kind of a beast, though. Yeah, maybe he knows something we don't. I don't know. Maybe he's just comfortable on it. Wow, I like that up air, but he didn't convert off it. Yeah, good laser. This is Remy commentating with uh, Blue Jay. Nice back air from Logos, perfectly spaced. 
He's dead. Alright, so set number two, we're gonna have Logos and Comets are both from loser side. Uh, coming up here in a second. Oh, calm down, dude. <laughs> but uh, it's looking pretty ripperoni and yeah, cheese. Especially after especially that. Especially after that. May I actually have a four stock? I'm just gonna start changing the, the results right now so that they're both in the uh, bracket reset. Carmaster probably just thinking about his Luigi stage choice for set two. Wow, fat knee. He's definitely thinking about how Dreamline is probably his best stage to go to, uh, but FD is up there too. Yeah, FD can be tough to avoid the lasers. When I watched Jekyll and Logos play, it was just like, stop, oh, no follow up. When I watched Jekyll play, it was just like, how do you get over these lasers or through them? I definitely wow. heard Logos' controller hit the huh. L button, but it just did not happen. <laughs> yeah, I can stop, man. Logos pulling the net, or not Logos, uh, Crowmaster, doing the net and just staying on the ledge waiting. Or the PC, your choice. He tried to do the uh, Fade jump back. in, wave line out. To avoid the get up attack. Yeah. Shut up, Kevin! He's dead. No? Ooh, he he double jumped a little bit too Yeah, soon. he didn't get up there all the way. A uh, shield. I feel like Falcon could do just about anything here, except for giving the ledge. And Falcon sucks. You see how fast I was ready for that, guys? It's, it's, it's almost like I knew that Logos was going to win. Yeah. So, yeah, it's the reset. Um, yeah, now, now you've got the Luigi out. <laughs> I guess we'll just record both sets together. Yeah, they, nice they, they like I, to do it. Just I actually one. hate it when they split them up. Yeah, it doesn't make sense, because then if you watch the first one, it's like, well, i got to go find the second one now. Yeah. The second one might not be uploaded yet, or it might have been uploaded earlier. Yeah. And it spoils it when you accidentally watch set two before one, and you're like, ah, oh, this sucks. But they go to Battlefield. The one thing about... I feel like... <coughs> <coughs> the one thing I feel like about everyone in this matchup is, like, just play it patient against Luigi. Wow, nice power shield. Like it's, he'll throw out the dare. It's Luigi, but this Luigi has definitely leveled up. Like it's, it's not you know. I just mean against like every Luigi. It's like, true, play but patient. like there's a big difference between you know Leprechauns, for example, and between. Oh yeah. Comets. Like I was listening to the Moon talk about the matchup, and yeah, that's Marth. But just like if you're under him, unless you know like you're gonna get a follow up, like on that shine right there, let him throw out the aerial, and then go up and hit him. Like, time that right. Especially the Nair. Like, the Nair will just come out in times when you don't think he can break the hit stun. But... Oh, that was a really good up tilt. Yeah. Um, how much are definitely di for the shot? Hit? Nice platform cancel. I feel like it's so hard he's, to tech. He's dead, yeah. Yep. There's just nothing you can do about that. Especially that was, as Falco, I mean... Yeah, that was just a you're dead situation. You know, you could try to dip lower and make Comaster go out there with more. That fireball but hit the Fox that, or with the... Would that firebox, fireball have hit Fox because he has the hitbox on his firefox? Uh, yeah, I think it, it would have. Yeah, I guess if when he's not moving. Nice back here. Good bear. <laughs> Both of us, but good back here. You know what? We'll get, we'll get that one to you. <laughs> he caught Comaster on his jump with the laser, which... When you're that close to Comaster, the lasers just never work. He, we talked about this in the car on the way up here. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. John, the, the stream guy, always points out to us that like in order to beat this Luigi, instead of playing a horizontal game, play the vertical game. Be either above or below him because he's going to beat you on the ground with his movement. Yeah, in a lot of characters, you don't want to be above your opponent. Luigi doesn't really have many good hitboxes above him, though. Like, I don't think his up air is that much of something to be afraid of. His nair is. It's like frame three. It's like one one more thing that Sheik has over Luigi is that like when Sheik's coming down, she has a really hard time. But Luigi has a hard time keeping like keeping yeah. both characters up and like killing from above. Especially with how slow he is in the air. Oh, uh, these four tilts. Four tilts are so good. Yeah. Wave dash four tilt, wave dash down smash is just like such a B and B thing for Luigi. I am the day man, man, man. I see you Tuesday. What up Tuesday? Dude, it was fun seeing you last time you came to Utah, man. I still have... I, I don't know who Tuesday is, dude. He Fighter was, uh, of the Night Bot, yeah. Who's <laughs> our Ice Climbers player. Yeah, I, I've heard of him. Like, I've heard Legends. Him yeah, and dude. Melee Ruler and Tomacock. I've all... I've just heard Legends about, dude. Yeah. 
Tom Manly Tom Ruler you, was did that. Did you see that Tomahawk was thinking about coming back to the scene? Yeah, or at least like visiting just, Utah. Just like, Beautiful yeah, shine off the top. For this is probably the best stage for Luigi. Oh, yeah. They definitely, I mean, for, for Falco. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. No, I, I, I understood what you meant. And for, I guess, I just think against floaties. Like, yeah, shot when, when off you're the top. a floaty, this stage is not your friend. Yeah. Except for Samus. But Samus gets away because she's kind of yeah. not floaty, you know? Samus is and, like and weird anti-meta. Anti-meta or matter? Meta. <laughs> but, uh, Shine at the top can be DI'd, but, like... Oh, good oh. stuff from Logos. Beautiful. And that's going to be a stock. Beautiful recovery. Wow. Commaster didn't move fast enough, which is something you don't get to say about him very often. Co uh, Logos' shield looking like an M&M right now. So there again, like, he got the shine and jumped right oh. into it. Oh, Shorty, you can. He did the leprechauns, the jab, the jab short, you can. Leprechauns always does that. Yeah. He, you can, I realize if you hit someone's shield with that, you fly like way off to the side. Super far back. It's like, so it's, it's hard for it's people really to hit you. It's really safe on shield, yeah. It's not like, you know, like actually, you can actually punish safe, them, but, but you're not going to be able to like. It. You're, you have to know beautiful. the situation. Nice drop, so. Because if you don't, it'll hit your shield and you'll just be like, what the heck was that, dude? Like, you would think you'll be able to set something up, like charge an F smash or something. Oh, he, Commaster DI'd in. He had to smash yeah. DI in so he, that the second downer wouldn't kill him. Double dip. Didn't quite dip this week. Randall being a homie. Not for Logos, dude. Yeah. Logos hates Randall. Like, lo I don't think Randall's ever helped Logos. Not once. He was playing SK in Vegas. And Logos had this sick, like, 0 to 90 combo and was about to dumpster him off the side of the stage. And SK landed on Randall. Dang, and it yeah. was so upsetting. I just, I was in the chat watching and I just said, I hate this game, dude. This yeah. game sucks. It's terrible. Why do we play it? And then I go home, or like, I was already at home. And then I go play, like, another game and I'm like, this game might suck, but it's so much better than every other game. <laughs> I don't know anyone who would like remove Randall though. You know what I mean? Dude, you can't. He's he's the heart and soul of the stage. Like a lot of people would remove stitches, maybe even misfires. But Randall, no one everyone loves him. Everyone's gotta keep Randall. Even when he burns you, like, I hate I hate the Shy Guys way more than I hate Randall. Yeah, Shy, shy Guys. Guy shy going. Guys mess the game up in like a weird, unpredictable way. They also buffer moves. I got hit by a forward smash last night that was buffered by like Yeah. I got like hit by a forward smash that was buffered by like five fly guys. It really sucked. Yesterday versus Smooth. Oh, the jab forward smash. He should be dead if Logos can get the edge guard. And he does. Set count's now 1 1. Logos coming out against this Luigi. Commaster looking like he's having a good time. Even though he's got to be at work in about 12 hours. What time is it? It is pretty much 10. Yeah, in 11 hours, I'm sorry. Yeah, this is a. That's that's why Luigi. It just feels like he's not fair on this stage. Oh, that. the chain grab! Oh, wow, no. beautiful. This is so. Oh, oh my gosh, gosh. dude! If it if that had happened, I, I don't even. Oh my gosh, that chain grab is so hard to oh, execute. Oh, good shorten. Yeah, I know, right? Like, I, I complain about how hard. I complain about like Marth stuff on FD, Peach stuff on FD. I have no room to talk. Doing that is really difficult. And, and Commaster doesn't like to do that. He does not like chain grabbing. Yeah. He, he hates it. He thinks it's stupid. And it's like a, a, an unfun one, unfun way to play the game. That's why like he always talks about Fable as like the most boring person in Utah. Oh. I, I think everyone talks about Fable. He's not wrong, dude. I mean... Fable's just so, he's so one-dimensional boring, but like he's so, his fundamentals are really good. Wow, so up till up B, it's not gonna kill. Did he get the aerial one? I feel like he might have. This is a bracket yeah. reset grand finals. He, was it a 3-0 against Falcon? Oh yeah, he he came out strong. Yeah, um. And now he's gonna get forward tilted. One thing I feel like fighting <laughs> Luigi, it I is. Love, I love being right. Yeah, he's dead. Wow. Oh, wow. 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 right there. I yeah, I said right. he's. I said he's dead. I was talking about Ammon. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like maybe just taking the ledge might have been there. I don't know. That was a beautiful up tilt, but then the air dodge yeah. is just going to get you kicked in the mouth. Or the beak, rather. Oh, my. Wow. What the Logos. I don't know what that, that was. That was, uh, just do it again. Go to the next match. One thing about Luigi, it is really hard to tech sometimes. Like, he'll up tilt you. Those are so strange. Oh, good stock right, from Logos. Back time. After the SD, he's just all about it. It's hard to even explain, because, like, he'll up tilt you, and you try to tech the up tilt. But then he'll, like hit you with something else right after it, and you've missed the tech window for that next move. Yeah, so, it barely pops you up, so you try to tech the first thing. And then yeah, or like his up throw. Yeah. You try to tech that, 
the old up smash wow. and you can't tech Mogus is right back in this after the SD. Mogus bringing He's this mad, back dude. for sure. Oh, power shield. Mogus needs to stop air dodging by accident. Carmaster's power shields Those are Those Shinens out of shield were so good. Carmaster will like power shield immediately wave dash in. It's so sick. Yeah, or, oh boy, oh or boy. he'll power shield and forward air immediately. Yeah. Up till oh he he respected that Carmaster could have neutral aired and would have broken up the combo and put Logos in just like a really bad situation. He grab released. Oh oh. Oh, oh he's man, dead. Logos paid his hard out. No SD. Match. Logos is playing great. Yeah. Yeah, no SD. Logos would have an entire another stock to go about it that. Taking two with just one stock and then about to, you know, try to go another one. He had a good 60%, but that's the worst part the SD of it. Just, it's terrible. That's the worst part about us being just like a what could have been moment, you know? You think about it, you're like, what if I On did the other this? side, like, maybe Commaster took off some gas when he was up three stocks to one, so. Uh, you know, it's subjective. Yeah, you just can't say, like, Logos would have won if he had SD. It just would have been different. Yeah, exactly. It nice wouldn't have nice ended start the way here, though. Ooh. Wow, that's tight. Logos abusing his invincibility. Laser forward tilt, the PPMD. Shine, up tilt, down air again. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Just wrapping out uppies. Ooh, shine back he didn't Logos. Dare. Logos is so, like, is like ridiculously fast at, at the, the shine aerial. Shine back air yeah. being, you know, the most like, of, of course, the most relevant. I mean, one. against like a. He's dead. That's yeah, that's a dead Luigi. Against a Luigi at like 130, Shine Bear's got to be tough to connect, right? Like. Shine Bear is like yeah, exactly. I've seen Logos. He's talked about it a lot. I've seen Logos shine back air at Jigglypuff at like 180 percent. Shine off the top. Whoa! Yeah, dude. Logos. Yeah. Coming out so hot. We might see Logos game five. Logos is keeping the momentum from from the FD game, and he's going up on him right now. This should be an edge guard. Oh, this shortened doesn't quite get forward tilted. Look what's going in right now. Is this the first four stop? No, he's he's dead. Never mind. I that should back. be it. Oh! Should have been it. Another four tilt. Oh, Commaster's missing ledge guards. Oh, he has. He, he hits him with the wrong spike. hitbox. Okay, but he got the drop through platform forward air. You can that... hear Net from five miles away going, "Ooh!" Whether it was relevant to this or not, it definitely happened. That's why I never see that, or I rarely see that spike hitbox. Like, oh, uh, it's that meteor. Really good at getting it. Or yeah, but like. Yeah, I know. I know what you mean. Sorry, I just, I'm sorry. I don't, no worries. I don't mean to be this way. <laughs> like you rarely want the spike hit the meteor hitbox. Though, He's right? really good at reacting to it though. Yeah. Usually it'll be like downer into like back here or something. So we're gonna have game five set two. This is yeah. nutty, game dudes. five set number two. Logos looking to knock Comaster out of his first Utah tournament ever. Um, actually, never mind. First Utah weekly. Yeah. Um, barring barring the set versus Sizz that he had. Yeah, I think he's like contemplating FD. He's harming over Yoshi. Uh, well, I don't think he can't go back to FD uh, if Logos doesn't want him to. Unless he allows it. Yeah, Logos, yeah, he's Logos say is no not going to allow it. I wouldn't go back to FD. Um, probably going to go to Dreamland, I would imagine. Dude, he's um, looking like he's maybe thinking Yoshi's. Yoshi's is a strange pick. He Have did. Comaster? Yeah, I was like, Comaster right, yeah, needs to remember he got shined a minute ago. I just, yeah. How is Logos going to fare with these particular four stocks in this game five? See, like right there, that's hard to tech. Or, I, mean, I, I agree. You pretty much have to guess which one you want to attack. You also have to guess that he's going to miss whatever, like, because he tried to hit him and he just missed. Yeah. Nice Ooh. forward smash from I Logos. I think no jump. I think no jump. And no side beat. Or oh, no down he beat tried charge. to down smash, but he, uh, yeah. he put it out about the same time he got hit by the upbeat. Back air. Logos has stage control. He's got the lead right now. No, Logos, oh, no. don't force it. What? Oh, he went for the edge guard. Com Master being a homie, let him back on the stage. Realized, hey, Even though your he's edge guard was 70%. really bad, but I'll, I'll let you back. Nice bear. That was such good coverage. He's dead though. Ooh, the double jab. Comments didn't see that coming, got hit by the second hit. Logos now doing the exact opposite of what that downer off stage was. He's playing yeah. super, super safe. I think that's the way to go in this matchup, dude. <laughs> um well like Shine back here is about as reliable as Shine Forward Tilt. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Oh baby. I feel like that's there we it. go, Logos. Yeah, no jump, no downbeat. Commaster looking like he's on his way out, unless he figures something out. Commaster, the master of zero to deaths, at least in Utah. Full stock lead. Oh, the jab was so good. So like I said, like, zero to deaths. Those so are all good. like tech mix up. Ooh. Logos is gonna make it back, resisting the Commaster pressure. Now I, Commaster playing a pretty. If safe Logos game. wins, he might punch a hole in the TV. I don't know. 
Ooh, that was perfectly, like, really well, like, thought out back air. He was like, what what damage can I realistically take if this back air does not hit? And uh, he went forward, he decided the risk was greater, or was less than the reward. I call that, I call that the Meta Knight, where he just jumps, and he's so floaty, he just, like, floats around your shield, lets you burn your shield up, and then, like, throws then out throws one out or two one. late aerials. And either tries to bait your out of shield, or just poke it, like... Oh, good nair. Thomas is off stage. Good air dodge. Oh, air dodge. Nice. He covered it, though. The up air, he went down a little bit so that there's really no way Commaster could have gotten out of both ends of the up air. See, I like that patience, though. Like, when Commaster's coming down, don't try to cover his landing. Let him land and then... Uh, there's there's two people in this Utah scene that you cannot down smash from the ledge. Um, and as long as Commaster's Luigi, he's one of them, you know? Yeah. The other one is Lada. Lada, you cannot down smash when he's Samus. He's so good at those sweet spots. Mogos gave back the ledge... Said, you know what, I'm just gonna forward tilt you. It's fine. Yeah, after that first stock, he almost oh, lost. Logos has one more stock to go if he wants to take this tournament. After that first stock, he almost lost. I think he's being a little more hesitant edge guarding. Oh, that was a good up tilt. The forward tilt knocks him off the stage. There. Goes low. That's, that's, it's all even. Just take that ledge, yeah. Last stock set, too. Let's go. Logos jumping into a counter. It was 3 0 for Logos the first set. Logos got some started. Signature combos. The up tilt trades with the Nair. The Nair doesn't quite send Logos anywhere. Ooh, on shield, not safe. Uh, Logos going for it. Oh, I don't know if he read that, but he... No. Oh, no. Okay. Don't do it to him. Oh, you rolled in. That's oh, no. it. This... Oh. Commaster's scared. I don't, yeah, that was dude. the most scared I've ever seen Commaster. Yeah, you he he just... Edgar. Yeah, exactly. Oh, Logos oh. takes it! Oh. Game five to Logos. Oh. Nice play. The first person in Utah, from Utah, to knock Kyle Master out of the bracket completely. Yeah, dude. That's crazy. So, uh, Logos', Logos PR just went... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good stuff, though, from, from Kyle Master. He's a solid number two okay. now, probably for a while. <laughs> yeah. Good, good play from both players. A lot of fun was had, I can tell.